A seventh homicide is now linked to the serial shooter targeting Maryville. Phoenix police say it's their number one priority right now, and they're asking everyone in the valley to help and call in tips to law enforcement. I spoke with Arizona's silent witness program where officers say that's the only way they will keep making advances in all arrests. In almost 40 years, Silent Witness has put thousands of felons behind bars and given out over $2 million in cash rewards. It's another tool to allow us to really vet what's critical and what can be followed up on the next business day. The 24-hour anonymous call-in program with a cash incentive connects you directly to detectives of Phoenix Police Department. We're looking for information on any felony crime and we have the ability to get that to the investigators. And Phoenix Police says calling in right now is crucial after a string of seven deaths and three other incidents happened in Maryville and Phoenix by the same shooter or shooters. We're asking everybody, whether it's our officers or our community, reach out with any information with any tips. That's really what it's going to take. Detective Mike Fisher has been answering silent witness calls for over 10 years and says they get calls from all kinds of people. You answer calls from all kinds of walks here. All kinds of people call us up. And says in this case, it's the community who is going to help catch these shooters. Nothing's going to be solved until we get a phone call from, uh, in this case, the public is going to help us. Detective Fisher said that after the sketch of the suspect was released last night, that more and more people have been calling in. Anyone of any age can contact Silent Witness at any time by either calling the numbers on your screen or by texting the word silent.